It may be tempting to focus on technologies or competition or, or new emerging players or partners, but uh, what we think is, is most important is that uh, the incumbent banks are focused on the customers. Because in the end, the customers will decide which services they will be using, and, and the customers may flee to other banks or other new service providers unless we stay competitive with our customers. So we're, we're trying to optimize the, the customer value that is created with the new emerging technology, and, and to, to do that, we research customer needs and obviously choose from the, the options that are available, including the, the various startups uh, available in FinTech scene. Well, FinTechs and other third parties need to, to learn the customer needs uh, by, by doing services uh, in, in a very humble and, and, and sort of nimble way. And, and that makes them a perfect partner for, for us as an incumbent. There are areas, uh, pockets of innovation where startups really excel and are able to move faster than we are. And, and that's definitely where we want to utilize uh, them and, and partner with them. Uh, but then of course there are other needs where we need other partners. Open banking in Nordea started before PSD2 as an opportunity oriented initiative. I mean, answering the question, how will we be profitable as a transaction bank in 2020? And that's how we see it, that it, for us, it's getting up to the next technology level. I think many banks now are at a crossroad where it's a pretty risky situation. So if you are reactive to what is happening, you might end up in, as a dumb pipe and you have lost the customer facing position. And the only way to hinder that happening is actually to be proactive and utilize this regulatory change and also this new technology to your own favor. We are very much looking into partnerships which will help us to create the next generation of corporate services. And that has turned out to be a challenge because most of the startups and fintechs in the Nordic area are looking at consumer services. And I think we will have to come away from that if we are going to find valuable partnerships for the future. We at the EDA, we understood at 2006 or 2007, a very early stage, that this digital transformation that was happening in other industries like the photography, the music and the film and the contents was going to happen eventually in the finance industry and the insurance. So we decided to anticipate and, and, and leverage on these new technologies that are giving so much power to the people. Digital ecosystems are evolving rapidly into platforms, into artificial intelligence driven platforms where they get the most of, out of, of data and the, the best, the most successful business models, Airbnb, Uber, Facebook, Spotify, they are platforms that connect together supply and demand and, they, they, and where the intermediaries play a different role. So platforms and big data are going to be the key differential uh, leverages or, or assets where we think that the industry is going. To operate in the open banking space, an incumbent organization needs curiosity, a permanent curiosity to understand to what is coming ahead, what is going to happen next, and being very humble to, to realize that you don't have all the answers and all the talent. And there is a lot of opportunities out there. And you have to be humble and open enough to, to, to welcome them and to, to integrate them with your systems. Mm -hmm.